Hi guys, here I am. I've been promising you blueberry burgers and finally today I hope we're gonna get them. So um, first thing though, I wanted to show you I am getting smaller. See, if I move further away I get smaller too. But I even have the tags on. These are my new size 14 jeans, which is exciting for me because when you were a size 22, going to 14 is awesome. So I'm going to put my apron on. Today I'm actually cooking up a little feast at, at lunchtime because um, I have to go to work. And because of my work schedule and because today's my day, my husband's day off, I'm going to go ahead and uh, cook us something for lunch, which I don't usually do. Um, today though, I have on this black lace apron that I found in my drawer when I was cleaning things out. And we've had a great time. Uh, my husband and I discussing who is leaving their black lace aprons in my drawer. See, the tags are still on it, too. So anyhow, I was happy to find it. But here's another picture. This is me larger here in the middle. This is my go-to girl, Marsha, who gave me the blueberry burger recipe. And I'm altering it today to be a little bit more Slimming World friendly. And I want to give a little shout out to my girls in Great Britain and those of you watching. <laughs> So happy to have you. I mean, we're exchanging ideas across the pond. I love it. So today I'm altering Marsha's recipe for blueberry burgers to make it more Slimming World friendly. Um, hers has two pieces of bread all crumbled up in it. I'm not doing that. Um, I've altered it. And I'm also gonna make another alteration today from the last time I made these because I told you about the hatch chilies and I've individually frozen these and I'm gonna put a hatch chili in, in this recipe today for another layer of flavor. I need to alter this and write it down. All right, so by the miracle of television, and I wish I had Rachel's cameraman because mine's in school, I have blueberry burgers and I have about a pound of ground beef and I'm adding Worcestershire sauce a few thins of Dijon mustard, some balsamic vinegar, coarsely ground pepper, can't get enough of that, garlic, which I love, salt, and then I have taken some oatmeal dry oatmeal and uh, I only had the whole kind so I have worded up a little bit in the chopper and I threw some of that in instead of the breadcrumbs and I'm gonna get I'm gonna have the recipe available on my blog spot today so if you want to see it it's laurelwright.blogspot.com but I'll have the I'll have it written in the description of this video and you can link to it and that'll be great so that you can get the recipe for this. I'm also serving Slimming World fries for it, fries with it today. They're awesome. And um, I woke up in the middle of the night craving spinach. What's that all about? So I'm gonna do spinach. I have fresh spinach and I'm gonna do spinach. And I, I don't know, spinach salad or sauteed spinach or maybe both because I'm really craving spinach. So um, yeah, that's weird, isn't it? No, I'm not pregnant. So by the miracle of television, I have blueberry burgers here for you. They're gonna go out on the grill so I can be in time for work. And right about that time, the fries are gonna come out of the oven and we're gonna have a delicious lunch already before I go off to work. So I have four, I've made four blueberry burgers and they're perfect. And there they are. So I hope blueberry burgers are something you try the blueberries. You can see the little dark pieces. They just add a little bit of moisture. And until next time, I love your comments. Keep them coming. I'm getting smaller.